Alright, Katie Sampson here with the Nashville Community Darkroom, and I'm here to take you guys on a sad little tour of my darkroom facility inside my house. So, let's check it out and see what we got. Step right up. Alright, let's see what we have. We're going to start over here with my chemical storage, which, as you can see, is rather crowded and sad. So basically we've got most of my wet collodion chemistry and some albumin chemistry. Camera not wanting to focus because it's a dark room, not going to fight that. And then we've got some film processing equipment down here. Graduated cylinders and reels. All kinds of little tools. And then some tin type supplies and photo paper. As you can see, it's not too organized. But it is what I have with space and so I'm working with it. Alright, let's check this area out now. And if it were daylight, you could actually see how many light leaks I have. Alright, this is my workbench. Look at all that silver nitrate stain. Yeah, looks good. That'll probably disintegrate in the next six months. And some storage for my trays. Pretty gnarly silver nitrate stain. Hope my landlady isn't watching this. Let's see. Safe lights <laughs> that are actually clamp lights. Not really cutting it. And then we'll check out these margers over here. And you can see they don't have dust covers. They're not protected really from anything in this environment. Kind of sad. And the real tragedy are these beautiful boys down here. My 4x5 enlargers, which I have no storage space for at the moment, so they're just chilling right there on the floor. It is pretty heartbreaking if you're a film photographer. You should be crying right now. And over here, we've got some negative binders, some more film development chemistry, and just prints just laying all over the place. My photo professors would want to shoot me right now. Yep. It's a sad day. Once again, just to stress how inadequate the lighting is in here. A completely useless safe light. Yep. Well. It's not too big of a space. So, that is about the extent of the tour. So I hope you've had fun checking out where I make my prints, but most importantly, I hope you feel sorry for me. Go contribute to the Nashville Community Darkroom so that sad sack photographers like me don't have to keep this charade up.